Hi, everyone. I'm Lisa Copeland, and I'm a dating coach for women over 50. And I've helped so many at this time in their life find the right guy to share their heart and life with. And today I want to talk to you about something really important, and that's what I learned about love that I know can help you too. You know, I remember when I first started dating, I would go crazy worrying about whether or not a man liked me. And when I was in the process of doing that, I was actually forgetting how amazing I am. And that was probably because in those days, I wasn't sure I was so amazing. I didn't have self-confidence. And even worse, I was actually giving my power away to men because I was so worried about what they would think about me. Because what happened was I read profiles that men had written up and they would say things like, I'm looking for a woman who is a professional. She's petite. She's thin. She has blonde hair. Have you ever had that happen? Read a profile like that? Well, what that does to you when you read that is it can really make you start critically assessing yourself. And you might look down at your body and you might think, hmm, am I thin enough? My body's curvy now that I've gone through menopause. You know, I do have a great job, but is this what this guy really wants? And my hair, well, my hair is brown. So maybe if I put some blonde highlights in it, it'll work. And what happens is, is if you read enough profiles that describe specifically what men want, what ends up happening is you end up feeling like maybe you're not enough. And by the way, when you read and look at the pictures in women's magazines, you can get this same feeling because so much unrealistic Photoshopping is done and they're not even real. So you've got to be very careful about thinking that you're not enough. You actually are. I'm here to tell you that. And I want to say it again to you. You are enough. And what's happened is you've just forgotten. That's it. And I want you to be able to bring your greatness back to you. So recently, I was walking my dog in the morning. This relates to bringing your greatness back because I love listening to classes while I'm walking. It's very inspiring to me, and it really starts my day on a good, in a good way. So this poem was by Mary Morrissey and Jennifer Jimenez. And as I listened to it, it, it was just touching my heart. And I wanted to share it with you because it's so easy to forget how amazing you really are. And you are amazing. So I'm going to read it to you, okay? Who are you? You are woman. You are beautiful. You are powerful. You are sensitive. You are loving.